Casper, welcome to Meadow Lane. How does it feel to be a Notts County player? It feels uh, very good. Uh, I had a good feeling about Notts County for, for some time now. I had a good, uh, good first impression. I'm sure our supporters are already trailing Google for all the videos and clips of you, but can you just explain in your own words what sort of a player you are, what your preferred position is and what you're going to bring to the team? Uh, my position is I'm a centre midfielder, uh, like to get on the ball, uh, technical player, wants to play, uh, which I, I heard this, this team wants to as well, it's a, it's a playing team, so that suits me very well. Um, and obviously I got some experience, I'm 28, it's, uh, it's young, but in football world it's, it's, it's quite old already. I uh, felt like I was 20 just yesterday, so I tried a few things uh, and I'm very hungry to to play games, to come back on, on my level I was on before, so that's that's yeah why I'm here. You've had a fascinating career so far, obviously you've won several caps for Denmark, you've played against England at Wembley, just sum up your sort of career so far and what's brought you here? Uh, well obviously I was coming into the Danish national team very early when I was uh, 20, so uh, as you said I played against England, so at that time it probably wasn't looking like I was going to play for Nuts County at the moment, but you know I haven't played much the last uh, year and two, uh, so this is a perfect opportunity for me to come here, play some games, uh, hopefully go up, as I think the club is, is aiming for as well, you know, that's what I'm coming here for as well. Um, so let's see what happens, hopefully stay here uh, for a longer period. You obviously had a spell at Motherwell most recently, you know, what happened there? It obviously didn't seem to go the way you or the club planned it to, to go. Uh, it's difficult to say, you know, it's probably just football sometimes. Uh, never really had a chance uh, of getting any games, so when you're not getting a chance and you don't play, it's, it's always difficult to say what, what went wrong. Uh, but, you know, I like people there. It was a good club, good people, good uh, teammates, everything. But obviously, you know, I was there to play and I didn't, so that's why I left. And it's not your first experience of playing in England here, because obviously you played for Leeds United as well, a massive club. That must have been a fantastic experience. Oh, it was. It's a, it's a massive club, as you said. Uh, you can maybe compare that a little bit to Leeds when I was there. <laughs> they want to go up in the Premier League and we want to go up here as well. Uh, but yeah, it was a great experience. It was a big club. Uh, they got a big crowd. I know you got a quite big crowd here as well, even though we are down in this league. So that shows a lot of things about the club too. So. Hopefully we can go up like they did this year. Yeah, as you touched on, the aim is promotion this season, of course, to take yeah. Notts County back into the football league. You know, how good is it to come to a club with such a clear vision? Oh, it's perfect for me. You know, uh, I love when you know you got a clear vision. You know what you want. Uh, that's how I am as a as a person, as a player myself as well. So uh, it's not going to be easy. I can tell. You know, it's it's a difficult league to go up from. But I think we got a very good squad. Uh, looking at some of the games you played last season. Uh, just missed out in the in the final, but uh, hopefully we can do it next year. And obviously, you have two compatriots in our in our owners, Christopher and Alexander Rates. Uh, you know, is that a, any sort of attraction for you, or is it just a coincidence? Uh, obviously, I spoke to them both. You know, uh, and I'm very happy it, it worked out now. Uh, I really look forward to come here. Uh, had a good chat with them. Had a good chat with the manager. Um, so it just feels good all the way around. So yeah, I'm really happy about it. And the timing is perfect as well because you know early next week pre-season will start with the whole uh, team coming back to train so you're not going to miss a single second of the preparations for the new season so you'll have a great opportunity to get to know all of your teammates, play in the friendlies and hopefully get off to a good start here at Knott's. Yeah, which is very good for me as well as you said because uh, I left Motherwell in, in February so I've been training with some of the players in Denmark while they were locked down as well but obviously I haven't been in a proper proper team, a proper sessions uh, for some time. Uh, my general form is quite good, you know, staying fit, you know, running, training with a personal trainer, but it will be good to get a, a full pre-season as well so I can get up to full speed. Every footballer is different in terms of their levels of natural fitness. So some struggle really early in pre-season and then get better gradually. Others, they take to it like a duck to water. What are you like? Are you dreading Monday? Nah, I'm pretty much like always keeping fit. As I said, you know, I haven't played for for pretty much six months now, but I'm still running every day. Uh, I had to, you know, so I want to keep fit. And when the chance got here, now I'm here. So it's it's quite good that I that I stayed fit. Uh, you don't have time to, to take a month before you're ready. So I'm ready for Monday, definitely. You've had a look around the stadium and the facilities. You've obviously had your medical. Uh, what do you what are your first impressions of, of Meadow Lane and the club? Very good impression, I must say. You know, I've been to, to different clubs. Um, 
if I look at the, the dressing room and everything, it's it's like when I was in Leeds and that was championship. So you know, it's it's actually pretty similar to that. Uh, so it's it's a very good impression. Uh, can't wait to get to get started. You've literally just arrived from Denmark. You've been sort of taken straight from the airport to here to sign the contract and to have a look around. So now everything's done. What are you going to do in Nottingham? <laughs> going to find a place with my girlfriend. <laughs> We're going to find a place to live. Obviously, that's uh, that's important to get a to get a base so you can settle in uh, completely. But uh, just looking forward to to see the city. I've never been here. I've only been to London. I've been to Leeds, obviously where I lived. Uh, been to a few other few other cities in England, but never Nottingham. So I heard good things about it. So can't wait to find out myself. The fans would love to hear you say that, Casper. <laughs> welcome to Nottingham. Welcome Thanks to North County. Thank and we wish you all much. the best. Thank you very much.